back to an unboxing from, as you can see, Diamond Art Club. I have new kits. I got them out of the box. They're still sealed though. Because I want to unbox them together with you guys. Uh, I waited for a while since the last time I ordered from Diamond Art Club. And I don't need new kits. Let me just say that first. Um, so, last time I ordered was in July or the end of June. Uh, because free shipping was gone, now free shipping is back and they're paying the taxes and stuff and the fat uh, for when you're in Europe so I felt safe enough to order again and some kits that I wanted for a while were in stock uh, and I just picked one extra because I had a lot of points to spend as well so I used the coupon for my points uh, because I was worried they're gonna expire soon and that would be just a shame that's the way you convince yourself, right? That you need new paintings. Um, so yeah. We're gonna check this little one out that I ordered. Which will be cool. And I also uh, ordered the... The release papers. So I will show you those in one of the other two. Because I got three kits, so maybe the last one. We'll see. We'll start with this one. And this is actually, uh, like I said, not a big one. So hopefully it fits on here. I was like, where's the little sticker? <laughs> but it's crumpled up in the box. So that definitely needs to lay flat. Because that's really... Uh, like you can see, really up. But this is black and white, of course a horse painting. Uh, and let me just see, it's by Deborah Lewis. It's around and it's uh, 45 by 32, so definitely an easier one. Sorry for the lighting, that's just because it's also pricked up. As you can see, uh, the pointy bit sticking out of the back. Uh, but we got a nice toolkit from the Mark of the round one, so it doesn't contain um, the tweezers, but it does contain the pen, uh, the comfort, little grip thing, uh, wax, two pieces of heart shaped wax, uh, a multi placer, mostly the tin four placer, yes, it is, and the tray, of course, clear tray. And a lot of baggies. Oh, this is so cute, so tiny. That's gonna be amazing and very tempting to start as well. Oh, this has an old glue again that you can't easily open up the bag. I'm trying to keep it alive, but that's very hard. Maybe because it's also an older kit, so... I'm just trying to get the drills and stuff out. There we go. Uh, also, a little bit of a fold in the, in the sticker sheet here. Uh, luckily, there's not too many colors, so all the... Uh, if there would be more colors, it would have been worse. But because of the fold there, it would have been not that nice, but there's not too many colors. Uh, there you go, black and white, as you can see, just one AB, uh, but it is the new stair sheet, so that's cool. That's the image. Uh, 16. So this also was a bit wrinkled, it's just a step-by-step -step instruction booklet, I don't even look into that. And this is the drills, we'll take a look in a bit. Let's just roll this one back, because it's tiny, so it's not gonna lay flat easy, like some of the bigger kits. Ooh, let's just give it a bit. And now we'll see. There we go. Let me see the angle. There we go. <laughs> there it is. Look at that. That's 
so cute and I don't think I have such a tiny DAC so that's cool very cool oh actually the AB is not a number in this one it's a stripey symbol I can see it all over already so that's cool this is just a nice pretty horse with some nice background I do like this one Wish it had been on my wishlist for a long time, but every time that I felt like I could buy something, it was not in stock. So um, that's why I ordered it now. Um, do you, drill thrill do look nice because this is an older kit, so I'm just looking very closely. Uh, I mean, it's an older kit, they have it for longer time just giving you a quick look I can't do it up anymore I'm sorry just some of the white areas look all these stripes that you see that's gonna be a B there's quite a lot actually and there's only one so that is nice so Let's just go fast because this one isn't too big. So let's just look at the drills. Because I'm actually filming this during the, the break, the lunch break of my work. Because I'm working from home again today. So I couldn't wait. Mm, I see it already. Oh right, it's just one strip. That's nice. That would be don't won't be too hard to remember how to fold that back up. So let's zoom you guys in. In I said. Then I have to find out where I am. Look at that drill. That doesn't belong there. <laughs> there you go. Three eight six five. I'm not gonna call all the numbers though. That would be just a waste. That's all the three ten though. I thought that would be more. But that's okay. Oh, there's 939. That, that explains it. It's probably a mix of both of them. And there we have it. The AB. Look how sparkly. 125. That's quite a bag for such a small painting. But as I said, it's everywhere. So very muted tones for this painting. Uh, but that's fine. Yeah, lots of grays. Ooh, this is nice. This is a nice difference. Like the blues are very nice. So, because I said that, there's gonna be even more blues. There you go, that's all the colors actually. <laughs> That was the quickest I've ever done such a thing. And look at that, you can just fold it up easily and get it back into the bag. So I will do that. Uh, just one more last look. Oh, of course, I'm still zoomed in. There you go. There we go. That is black and white from Diamond Art Club. Um, it's very pretty. I do have to say, I thought it would be more color blocking, but there is definitely color blocking confetti in here, which I kind of like more and more. But there's definitely areas where there's even more confetti. Uh, so I don't think it will as go as you would think, but I still think it can go pretty quickly because it's not too big and it's around. And I can multiplace with round drills, so that's very nice. Um, so yeah, that's gonna be it for me for this video today. Uh, keep around to see the other two unboxings from the kits that I got. So I got one, uh, two more, and I got the release papers. I will show you those in one of the other videos as well. Um, and yeah, I'll see you soon. Thanks so much for watching, I'll see you the next time, bye!